Taming the Dragon India is emerging as a powerful player in South China Sea. Please subscribe to the channel and like the video. Let's delve into the video. China's policy of hurting Indian interests in the Indian Ocean region have come back to haunt it, as India steps up its activities in the South China Sea. The good times are over. The era of India remaining indifferent, or a mute spectator to Chinese aggression in the South China Sea is long behind us. Today, China is facing an India which is not shying away from dispatching its naval assets to the South China Sea, publicly so. China has repeatedly tried to counter Indian influence in the Indo-Pacific, and now, it is trying to undercut New Delhi in the Indian Ocean region IOR. That is an area India considers as its strategic backyard. This has necessitated India to shift gears and take a more vocal stand against Beijing in the South China Sea. There is a visible shift in the way India is now approaching its Indo-Pacific policy. One could argue there is a doctrinal shift underway, one which is leading India to effectively take the fight to the South China Sea, a region which Beijing illegally stakes complete dominion over. In a sign of that shift, India is stepping up strategic maritime cooperation with a host of Indo-Pacific nations. Case in point being India's growing partnership with the Philippines. Amidst the ongoing Philippines-China naval standoff, an Indian warship, INS Kadmat has arrived in Manila for a goodwill visit. The Indian warship visit is part of the ongoing long-range operational deployment, which includes a wide range of engagement between personnel of both the navies. However, the real story begins with what INS Kadmat is scheduled to do after departure from Manila. In a significant move which highlights India's foray into the South China Sea on the side of nations victimized by China's growing aggression, INS Kadmat will take part in a maritime partnership exercise MPX, in the West Philippine Sea. In a statement the Indian Embassy in Manila said that INS Kadmat and BRP Ramon Alcaraz, an offshore patrol vessel of the Philippine Navy will take part in the MPX exercise. India's envoy to the Philippines, Shambhu Kumaran made New Delhi's intentions clear, as he said that India will continue supporting Manila in calling for the adherence to a rules-based order and respect for international law in the South China Sea.